The Fresno Bright Spot. Diffraction and the Wave Theory of Light. Diffraction of light is not limited to situations of light passing through a narrowing opening, such as a slit or pinhole. It also occurs when light passes an edge, such as the edges of the razor blade in the in figure. Look at this, and look at this. The Fresno Bright Spot. Diffraction finds a ready explanation in the wave theory of light. However, this theory, originally advanced by Huygens and used 123 years later by Young to explain double slit interference, was very slow in being adapted, largely because it ran counter to Newton's theory that light was a stream of particles. Austin Fresno was a young military engineer who, believing the wave theory of light, submitted a paper to the French Academy of Sciences, describing his experiments and its wave theory explanations of them. This is the picture Fresno delivered. Okay. He shined a light through a circle. Okay. And they found this picture. Yeah. And this, this the blood, a spot at the center is the last place we're looking for the light. Nothing bears confidence in the theory so much as having one of these unexpected and counterintuitive predictions verified by experiment. Although light has properties similar to those of waves, the wavelength of light is so small that we seldom notice the wave-like nature of light. This pinpoint light source will allow us to demonstrate that wave-like nature. If we put the light source behind a small sphere and look at the light coming past the sphere, we see a pattern around the edges caused by interference between different waves of light. Notice the bright spot in the center of the sphere where we would normally expect no light at all. 